As you already know, the BLWFX2 and maybe if you're just a general user of MT4 and you're either thinking about switching to a Mac computer or you already did, then you probably have issues, you know, with the installation of MT4 on your Mac computer. And I promised before that I was gonna make a video showing you how to install the MT4 to your computer. And uh, this is exactly what I'm gonna do in this specific video. Hi everyone, this is Christian here on YouTube and welcome to a brand new video for the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to install your MT4 on your Mac uh, computer. It could be either an iMac, a MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, whatever it is. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. This is a very easy way to do it, but if in case you haven't uh, you know, been able to install the MT4, this is the tutorial. If you're new to my channel and you're into binary options, forex trading, crypto trading, or any type of making money online, this channel is for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and activate the notifications bell icon so that you get a notification for every new video that I upload. With that being said, let's jump into the video. everyone and uh, in order for us to use this or to install the mt4 in our mac computer we are going to use a broker called xm i try to do this with just the uh, uh installer i try to do this with uh, ic markets and other brokers and this is the only one that worked for me and it was super easy to use so that's the reason why i'm going to be doing it i have a link to xm below in the description of this video in case you don't have an account with them you don't really need to open an account with them to be honest but this is the broker that we're going to use to install it okay once you are in the website all you need to do is go to platforms and choose mt4 for mac and it's going to display a new picture a new window whatever you can close this and uh here it tells you everything so on you can open a demo account which i would recommend you to do so open a demo account with them or a real account is really up to you i'm gonna make a, a different video in regards to this broker and you can hit a download and it will download this uh package deal or package software or whatever it's about 500 megabytes it's gonna start downloading and right now it's gonna take about seven minutes and uh, then we will be able to use it in the meantime while this ends uh installing in case you want to know anything in regards to this broker like i said i'm gonna make a different video in regards to it but you can read everything it's got a very low deposit and so on now the reason the main reason why i'm teaching you exactly how to install it on your mac computer is because i see a lot of people like having issues getting the blwfx tool for instance which is the brand new forex application that we released on december 1st and uh many people want it and that's awesome but the problem is that they don't they have a mac computer and they don't know if it will if it will be suitable for them so yes i'll go ahead and, and install the mt4 and then everything else is exactly the same as if it was a windows computer so yeah if you're planning to get the blwfx tool and by the way I have the link in the description, it's blwfxtool.com. Then you can go ahead and get it and use this tutorial to install the MT4 on your Mac computer. All right, so now that it's actually finishing the download, it took more than expected. Then uh, what we need to do is open the folder, which is usually right here in the finder. I think it's actually right there. Yeah, in the download section. If you notice, it's the second one because the first one. All right, now that it's actually there, what we need to do is just click on it and it will open the form to install it. It's very simple with a uh, Mac computer. Right now, it's kind of downloading the or verifying the package. If you notice right here, it says MT4 package can be opened because Apple cannot uh, or cannot check if it's a malicious software. So that's okay. We're gonna hit okay. And what we're gonna do is that we're gonna go to the system settings, settings, there you go, system preferences. And uh, here we're gonna open where it says, I think it's security. Let me just go ahead and make sure. All right, there you go. Security and privacy. We're gonna click on it or double click on it. And it's gonna open the 
and option. We're gonna go to privacy. Well, actually, if you notice right here, XM Global NT, it says was blocked from use because it's not uh, from identified developers. So you can click on open anyways, and that's pretty much it. In privacy, sometimes you do need to activate it, but right now, I don't think it's gonna be possible. It's gonna be needed, and as you can see, it's verifying it again. Uh, we can close this, and now it's gonna let us install it. You click on open, it gave basically the same warning. Then here, uh, you will need to click on continue and install it. And in my case, it's gonna be my uh, fingerprint for my password. But if not, it's just gonna require you for a password. This is a 2020 MacBook Air, by the way. So it says it's gonna take about four, mi four minutes for the installation. I think it's gonna be less than that. Pretty easy, right? It's even easier than with a Windows PC. There you go. And then we hit OK. And uh, it says, do you want to move the installate, uh, installate uh, installer pack to the trash? I'm just going to keep it in case I need it in the future. And now all you need to do is go to the um, search again and type in XM. So if you notice right here, we have an XM file. We're gonna double click on it. It's gonna take a little bit longer than with Windows. It's completely normal. And by the way, the MT4 is gonna be a little bit slower on a Mac computer. Right now, as you can see, it's opening the Mac, uh, the MT4 on a Mac right here is where you will need to choose the server okay the server can be anything that is related to your own broker for instance myself here i open my ic market uh broker account you can do that as well uh, any broker you have with your mt4 it could be even an xm uh broker but right now for instance i'm going to move all the way there's nothing here so i'm going to add and I'm gonna put IC markets and I'm gonna hit scan and it's going it's, it's supposed to pop up okay it didn't show me anything but let's go ahead and look up again okay there you go so here's where you're going to choose whatever is it that the server whenever you open an, an mt4 account you get these details i don't think i need to tell you this is the one that i have for instance so i'm right here i'm going to log in i hit and finish and that's it I'm already logged in into my broker account with IC Markets. Even though this was um, an MT4 uh, platform for directly XM, as you can see right here, I'm logged in with my MetaTrader 4 on MT uh, on um, on IC Markets. There you go. Now you can just set it to whatever features you need. As you can see, my balance is right here. My account history is right here. So we're good to go. So this is the easiest way to install MT4 on your Mac computer. Hopefully that's helpful for you. Hey, so if you found value on this video, make sure you smash the like button. And if in case you have any questions, you can put them in the comment section below. I'd be glad to answer those comments as soon as I can. And thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and smash the like button. And I'll see you on the next one.